Very tight. There's a big shout. Big shout. Pleading for it. Going to go upstairs. Pad then bat. That looked pretty dead for me. Death 100% uh, short decision pending. This will give us the story here. Just going to go through the process. Yeah, that's a legal delivery. There's no problem there. And we're just going to go down the line. And this will tell us the story. Did it hit the pad first? Yeah, it did. It did. And it looks pretty dead for me as well. That is plum. How did he miss that? Oh, that's going to be interesting here. Bat is nowhere near the ball. And it struck him on the pad. Back leg as well. But this is, will tell us the story. Did it hit him outside the line? Yes, it did. Well, well. Well, he will consider himself un unfortunately a Sakib. And um, good decision in the end. Confirmation, not out. Indeed. Base says it all. And the skipper. Either or. Doesn't matter. Just get one. Oh, you're crazy! Can you believe it? All the pressure! And these figures are absolutely tremendous. Best bowling figures in BPL this season, courtesy of the captain, Shaquille. Have a look at that. You better believe it. He's gone for the reverse. Missed it completely, taking the leg stump off the ground. What was he thinking? Have a look at them. Well, disappointingly, he's gone for four. Naheem Hassan won 14 for six. Six one down now for the Vikings at 114 here in strides big Robbie Freilink. Crucial moment in this match. This is just head scratching material. Naeem, what are you thinking, Chief? Huge risk against one of the best in the business on his home turf. <laughs> oh, says it all. One to go. Going to have a wicket maiden, are we? Seen a double wicket maiden here today. Crowding it in here. Rightio. Robbie Frylink, your first one. Oh, yeah, antsy. Wicket maiden it is. What a great set of figures. We'll come back to those. It's six down for 114. More. Ball in hand. He's bowled two overs for 11. Tricks up his sleeve. Oh, wave of the wand. They're on the charge. That's so often the case. You batters, you want to get the first one away. Get a boundary. What's Mossadegh going to do here? Beautiful length, really is. Don't mind that, let it through. I think crazy. Yeah, Russell's one to go. Rubel Hussain has got one as well. So you can imagine perhaps those two to finish out. Oh, hello. Yeah, some good timing. I'll take one and get Mossadegh back on strike. Half an over to go. Yeah, interesting times. Uh, they're just tightening the screws a little bit here. Sakib has been outstanding.
Well, neck and neck, set for the wicket. That's the issue for the Dhaka Dynamites. Now then, Shakib Al Hassan doesn't deliver reason he can go back to one of his numbers striking big guns ruble and andre russell with the other one up his sleeve here is the penultimate over ruble time would have been a different story full toss again straight to a man as the shy is direct hit you believe it he's got him he was way out Magic piece of fielding here at Mirpur. And they're loving it in the aisles in blue. Absolute cracker. Previous one, it's almost like an instant replay, this. Decided to take on the run. Want to come upstairs, but it's gone for all money. Absolutely. Bullseye. It's a shocker. Yeah. Because it's the man who's in and set. Mossadegh has got to go run out. More drama for 33. It's 119 for seven here. Adrenaline pumping here for the batting side. Can they get up? Oh, lovely little change of pace and well negotiated from uh, big Robbie Freiling. Mm. He's keen and happy to do this as Ruble. Sanzimal. Might be a wide, is it? Let's have a look. No, it's a no ball for the height, is it? Want to see this side on. He's saying he's got the signal from Ramon Martinez. It's all happening. Free hit. Oof. That's the signal from there, the no ball height. And it almost knocks over off pole. This is a cracker. Bravery from Ruba with a change up. Up and over. He'll be safe. Is it going to run away? No, good teamwork. They'll get two, and that's all. Nine minutes after 10 local time here in Dakar. Up and over. Safe, is it? Oh, just. And we've got Mahor bowling the final one. It's not Andre Russell. I like this. Having a look. You see. Head to. Hip hip hooray. This has disappeared for the maximum. Courtesy of Big Robbie. Simon Helmot. Emotionless. What a time to fat one. Yeah, it was always going to be a big ask as well. He's done it before. We've, he's taken the team over the line. Pretty much the same. Have a look at the length ball as well. 86 meters. That was in the slot. There for the taking. And he's done exactly that. He is a big man. And you do not want to leave it up until the last minute. At the same time, there's so much pressure. Nine required. It's a better place to bowl. Gonna get a hustle. Gotta come back for two. Ran wide, both of them. And in the end, Freilink almost uh, ran three because of the, the way they ran it at almost a big oval in terms of their running and getting back. Here we go. Uh, this is what you're talking about. Have a look at them go. Have a look at Freilink going in circles. Have a look at them. Go the long way, buddy. Make it, talk about making it difficult for yourself. <laughs> Very fortunate the throw wasn't near the sticks for Robbie Freiling. Sucking in the 0-2. The big guy. Oh, no! No! Try the length ball again. They're going nuts in the dugout with the Vikings. And Simon Helmet says, just take it easy. The game ain't done yet, but you'd have to think it is because they just need one from two. Those in red are going crazy. And I think we've lost a few of the lights here at Mirpur. Can you believe it? It's all happening, that's for sure.
and the, we just had a power. The Knights have gone out here, and Robbie Freilink, he's taking them apart in the last over as well. Well, it's all over here. Well, I think they just need to get on with this, even though we've lost a few lights in some of the towers. Scores are level. Yeah, the length again from Mahor. Now the umpires are uh, just having a little chat. But I think you just need to get on with this. Finish it off, yeah. They're very disappointed at the DACA fans. But uh, you got to hand it to Robbie Freiling. Big fella stepped up. Great night for him with ball in hand. Now he's doing it with bat as well. Two balls left. Shouldn't need it. And won't. Big guy's fatted another one. I think it's gone all the way. We'll just get confirmation. But big hugs and high fives and smiles all round for the Vikings here against the Dakar Dynamites at home here in Dakar. They have got up courtesy of big Robbie Freiling when it mattered. They go all the way. I want to check this. Is it four or six? Doesn't matter. Game's done. But yeah, it's right on the cushion on the full. It's the maximum. Yeah, give him all the credit. What a finish. What an emphatic finish that was from Robbie Freilink. He looked all calm. He's been good throughout this tournament thus, thus far. And have a look at them. All hat and shakes. Yeah, you better give it to them as well. They've been outstanding with the ball. And it was a good comeback. They made it look difficult. But in the end, Robbie Freilink, hats off. Yeah, but down to the last. Exciting there. Cricket fans, the tension in the Vikings dugout after the first ball just goes for a single and then it was up to Freilink. And did he deliver or what? Feel though for the bowler, Mahor. But he needed to step up. Great experience for young Mahor. Antor. But the second one goes for six. Then a brace, and then back-to-back -back maximums to finish things off from Robbie Freiling, who finishes 25 not out from 10. And uh, in the end, you'd have to say, deserved winners, I think, with that performance with ball in hand to restrict the Dynamites to 139 for nine at home, given they won the toss and went up front and wanted a bat first, were restricted to that low total. He's my man of the match, Vusi, Robbie Freilink. Yeah, good man he is. I mean, he's always been thriving this. He's always thriving for this situation. He's done it before. But have a look at that to take them over the line. Carved it straight over the bowler for six. Outstanding it, innings it has been. And look at them go. Look at the head coach as well. Exciting times for them. You better believe that he has actually done it. And why not? Yeah, great scenes here at Mirpur. Yeah, did the job, the big fella. From South Africa. Hane Kun, just uh, congratulate him as well. Coming second again, Shakib Al Hassan. First time at home this season. Vikings. They get there in the end after 19.5. There was a couple of scores in the 30s. Dalport and Mossadegh. And then uh, Mushvika, the skipper, got to 22 and then got out. And Freilink, 25 from 10 with three wonderful maximums in that final over. Had an ally there in Sunzimol get home with a ball to spare. And the Dynamite's in response. I mean, have a look at that. Apart from Shofu got home, he was expensive. It was tough going for them. But Shakib, outstanding he was. Best figures in the BPL. 24. 